Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 10 of Let's Play Final Fantasy 7, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, I say before we actually leave to go to the next area, what we should do is probably do a bit of shopping. Do I want another Restore Materia? I think the answer is yes. Do I want any more Materia of these elements? Probably not. I'm gonna hold off on that. So for now, why don't we just press onwards? Do we really need like two people healing at once? Well, given that my characters are mostly fighters, probably gonna hold on to that till later. Oh yeah, nobody's gonna be playing on this area anytime soon. That place looks real bad. Wait, actually I think there is one thing that I forgot to do. And that involves going back to the Don Corneo's mansion. I should be able to go in there now. You know, despite the fact that we were originally flung into the sewers last time. Maybe a lot has changed since then. Or maybe we can just check out some other rooms. I think we'll give that a try. I could be wrong though, but wouldn't hurt to see. Might also be a good idea to actually go to the end to rest. I should have done that off screen. Oh, you can actually go in that room now. I couldn't before. Is there anything good on TV? No. I didn't think so. Oh, there's a phoenix down. So, I guess that's a good reason to go over there. So you can get that for free. Also, why don't I go back in this room? Maybe somebody else is in here? Oh, God! Hey! You're... not them! You're... Please help me! You know what? I'll help you. Thanks. You know what? After you left, some Shinra guys forced themselves in here saying someone leaked information and we're good for nothings. They took Don somewhere and that's it. I'm still here. Oops. They're here again. I'm out of here. See ya! Why does he run like his arms are stretched out, like he's ready to strangle someone? But you know what? I think we're just gonna get out of here. Nobody's actually gonna come in here, so don't get the wrong idea. Alright, so we grabbed ourselves a free Phoenix down. Why don't we go to the inn, get ourselves rested. It's only 10 GP. No, 10 GP? It's Gil, you idiot! Goes to show I haven't played a Final Fantasy game in years. At least, for YouTube. I played Final Fantasy VI, but that was, what, 2012 or something? Or 2013? Either way, it was a long-ass time. So I think it's time for us to move on. Alright, let's go. I think now we actually want to go this way. I believe the place we want to go is to, uh, Eris's town? Which was the slums? Not exactly the most comforting of places, but it's a place we can go to regardless. So nice to have a full party this time. What does Sense even do? Level 11, 450 HP, and that's it. Okay. Doesn't tell me if I can actually steal from him. Nothing to steal, so there's no point to you steal against those guys. Wow, we actually can be pretty tanky compared to like where we were before against this guy. I like that. Tifa should have a limit break ready soon enough. And there we go. Alright, so. Hopefully we don't run, don't run into any, run into too many battles. At least we're getting a decent amount of money back. Whenever we fight. Oh, we were supposed to go this way, alright. Ugh, haven't seen these guys in a long-ass time. 
and I'm not happy to because they are so annoying. They have pretty fast speed too. Like sometimes you'll get attacked five times, even though there's only four of them. Couldn't steal anything. All right. I think we'll just wait till there's only one left and then try to steal from it to see what it's got. But I'm not gonna pass up the opportunity to use a limit break, of course. That can mean the difference between Tifa getting a new limit break or not. Okay, let's see what this one's got. Couldn't steal anything, so it's got something. I just can't get it yet. So I'm going to keep trying because I'm a stubborn piece of crap sometimes. Still can't steal. Like, certain enemies got, like, a percentage chance in which you can be successful. Sometimes it depends on the enemy you're fighting, or what the enemy has. Oh my god, come on now. Look at that, he just got two attacks within a few, just a couple seconds. Like, how is that even possible? Alright, I'm just gonna give it a couple more tries, and then I'm just gonna kill it. If anything, if I get another limit break, that's pretty awesome. Not really so much for Cloud, he's already got his level 1 limit breaks. Barret doesn't have his second one, Tifa doesn't have her second one, oh my god. Alright, one more try, and if you can't get anything, Barret's just gonna have to kill him with a limit break. A potion! It was just a goddamn potion. I wasted all that time for a potion. I was expecting something rare. Why would you make me go through all that trouble for a potion? Like, come on now. That just makes no sense whatsoever. Okay, oh, oh, yeah, it was this way, all right. Oh, I, did, I forgot you can still have battles here. Well, at least I know not to steal from these scumbags. Because that's just a big waste of time. Alright, so where should I go? Should I go up next? This wasn't going to go up here. I can go wrong. Even with all that commotion, you went on like nothing happened. You must have really been through the mill to get like that. <sighs> no kidding. First there was a rumbling, then cracking, and then kerbam! Or kerblam! I was so scared. <sighs> yeah, I would be too if something like that happened. Never thought that that would come tumbling down. Maybe I better walk around looking up from now on. Yeah, you, you, uh, do that. Hey, your daughter got kidnapped. Uh, what's her dinner? Cloud, wasn't it? It's about Eris, isn't it? Sorry. The Shinra have her. I know. They took her from here. They were here? That's what Eris wanted. Why is Shinra after Eris? Eris is an ancient, the sole survivor. What did you say? But aren't you her mother? Not her real mother. It must have been 15 years ago. During the war, my husband was sent to the front. Some faraway place called Wutai. One day, I went to the station because I got a letter saying he was coming home on leave. Yeah, 
Yeah, the train station still looked as bad back then, too. That's where it looked like the uh, arm was not swinging properly onto that pole. Wow, she had like bright red hair back then. No, wait, that's a different couple. Oh dear. How does she not have a broken back after that? And. Nope! Guess he didn't come home! No, It's so depressing. My husband never came back. I wonder if something happened to him. No. I'm sure his leave was just cancelled. Or is cheating. I mean, I went to the station every day. Then, one day... I'm guessing that girl in the blue is Eris? She does look a lot like her mother. You used to see this sort of thing a lot during the war. Her last words were, Please take Eris somewhere safe. My husband never came back. I had no child. I was lonely. So I decided to take her home with me. Eris and I became very close very quickly. That child loved to talk. She used to talk to me about everything. She told me how she escaped from some kind of research laboratory, and that her mother had already returned to the planet, so she wasn't lonely. Many other things, like walking through the wall. Return to the planet? I didn't know what she meant. I asked if she meant a star in the sky. But she said it was this planet. She was a mysterious child in many ways. Mom! Please don't cry. Eris just blurted that out all of a sudden. When I asked her if something happened. Someone dear to you has just died. His spirit was coming to see you. But he's already returned to the planet. At that time, I didn't believe her. But... Several days later, we received a notice saying my husband died. And that was it. A lot had happened, but we were happy. Until one day... We want you to return Eris to us. We've been searching for her for a long time. No! Never! Eris, you're a very special child. You are a special blood. Your real mother was an ancient. At that moment, I found out she was an ancient. The ancients will lead us to a land of supreme happiness. Eris will be able to bring happiness to all those in the slums. That is why Shinra would like Eris's cooperation. He's wrong! I'm not an ancient! I'm not! But Eris, surely you hear voices sometimes when you're all alone? No, I don't! But I knew. I knew about her mysterious powers. She tried so hard to hide it, so I acted as though I never noticed. It's amazing how she's avoided the Shinra for all these years, and that you wore the same green dress for decades! The Shinra need her, so I guess they wouldn't harm her. But why now? She brought a little girl here with her. Seng found them on their way here. She probably wasn't fast enough to get away. She decided to go to the Shinra in exchange for the little girl's safety. Marlene. 
Marlene? Eris was caught because of Marlene? I'm sorry. Marlene's my daughter. I'm really sorry. You're her father? How in the world could you ever leave a child alone like that? Please don't start with that. I'm always thinking about what might happen to Marlene if I... But you gotta understand something. I don't want any answers. I want to be with Marlene. But I gotta fight. Because if I don't, the planet's gonna die. So I'm gonna keep fighting. But inside, I'm always thinking of her. I just want to be with her. Always. See? I'm going in circles now. I think I know what you mean. She's upstairs asleep. Why don't you go and see her? Yeah, you do that, and I'll just go through all your stuff in the fridge. I mean, the counter. It's my fault. I was the one who got Eris involved in this. Don't say that. Eris doesn't think so. Sometimes Eris doesn't think at all. But anyways, I'm gonna go see Barrett. Uh, I don't want to sleep. I'm so glad. I'm so glad you're all right. Daddy, don't cry. Your whiskers hurt. Hmph. <laughs> That is true. Oh, I can't talk to him. Alright. Cloud! You're gonna help Eris, right? She's done so much for me. The Shinra are involved. I ain't staying here. I'm coming too. Guess what? Guess what? Eris asked me lots of questions. Like what kind of person Cloud is. I bet she likes you, Cloud. Let's hope so. I won't tell Tifa. Oh, watch now, she actually does tell Tifa right away. <sighs> okay, I think that's pretty much it. Maybe I can just leave. You're going after Eris, right? Yeah. I'm coming with you. We're going right to Shinra headquarters. You gotta be prepared for the worst. I know. Right now, I feel I have to push myself to the limit. If I stayed here, I'd go crazy. Yeah, considering it's not your house. Sorry, but can you take care of Marlene a bit longer? Yes, I don't mind. This place is dangerous now. You better go somewhere else. You're right, but promise me that you'll come back to her. Don't get yourself killed. I won't. How do we get to the Shinra building? There ain't no train that goes up there anymore. Well, let's go to Wall Market. We might be able to find something there. We just came back from Wall Market, damn it. Oh, uh, now we just gotta go all the way back to where we were. Isn't that peachy? So, we'll save, and then we'll just call it an episode. Stay tuned for the next one. Goodbye, everyone.